Hello, my name is Ryan Martin, and this is Desert Pagan, Clay Seymour, and Caitlin Floyd. We have been put to the task of designing the second Martin period honor roll party. In this video, we will explain our plans for the upcoming party. There will be time for questions at the end of this video. We chose the theme of a blacklight party because the majority of our survey votes went to a blacklight party over every option we had to offer. The blacklight's idea would make colored things look like they're glowing. We believe that this theme will be very fun and the kids will enjoy it. We will play music to make the honorable party more enjoyable and fun for everyone. The DJ will also be taking requests for songs in the office so kids can choose what they want to listen to. We chose a variety of activities that way everyone would hopefully be able to find something they enjoy to do with their friends. These activities include kickball, dodgeball, balloon stop race, face painting, and a photo booth. Kickball and dodgeball will be held in the main gym. Kickball can be played for the first half of the party, while dodgeball can be played from the middle to the end. In the, in the auxiliary gym, we will be hosting a small dance at this party. There will be black lights and music in this room. We will push the cafeterias to the side and have a balloon stop race. Face painting can be done with your friends in the art room, and a photo booth will be held in room 109, with props and decorations you can use to take pictures with. For snack options, we chose popcorn and potato chips because they were the most voted snacks by the kids in our school. As a beverage, we have Coke since it's a sweet drink, and that way the kids have something they can enjoy when they want to drink. But there will also be water available at all times. We've been giving a $100 budget to do everything we want to accomplish in this party. We will be spending about $50 on black lids and $20 on food slash drinks. In addition, we will also need about $10 worth of balloons. Cups will also be needed for the kids to use. This will take about $15. Also, we're going to look through anything we already have available from past honor roll parties and use anything we can. By December 22nd, we will know if our party has been chosen for the second morning of the If we get picked, we plan on setting a big donation box in the cafeteria so anyone can donate. All these details factor into our party plan. If you have any questions about our party plans, please feel free to ask them at this time.